Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and today we are playing Grenada here in the Open River Salus 4. That's right, Grenada. There we are. That's us. Wow, they're still hostile. Look at that. They're still hostile. It's like they just can't let go. Castile. What, what would be the reason for Castile being hostile with a nation in India? Look, our capital is here. Jaisalmer. That's our capital. We are Rajput culture in India. That's our capital. And Castile's like, oh my god, I hate you so much. Even Portugal's neutral. He's like, I don't know who the fuck you're talking about. Aragon's like, what? Who's who's that? You know, France's like, what? No. None of, the, none of these people have any memory that we ever existed. They simply know that, well, there's nothing down there now. It's just Castile now. But Castile, he's like, mark my words, Grenada. I will hunt you down, and I will kill every last motherfucking one of you. That's what he's thinking right now, that hostile. I don't know why. There's no need, but... He hates us anyway. All right, whatever. Timrids, on the other hand, have finally got it in their heads that uh, we are a nation to be trusted. And uh, yeah, he's actually actively improving relations with us. I like it. He's also improving relations with my ally. So maybe we can all like tag team Delhi and just take a whole bunch of shit off of Delhi. Um, I have no claims on Delhi, though. Maybe that's what I should do. Maybe I should claim these three provinces, the ones that border me. Central Doe would be a huge coup. I would love to get Central Doe because A, it's not his capital, so it'd be easier to get. But B, it's an important center of trade for my node, the Indus node. It is the only important center of trade on the Indus node, so I would love to get that and make it my capital. In any case, uh, we somehow failed, we failed our mission to annex Lower Sind. We had a mission to get access to the sea through annexing Lower Sind. I don't know how we failed it, but we failed it. We're still annexing them. It'll finish in five years. But somehow the game said, nope, nope, you didn't do it fast enough. You fail. It's like, what? It's still annexing. What are you talking about? Anyway, we're sitting here on the edge. Oh, we can tech up right now. We're sitting here on tech and up. Let's go ahead and do that. And uh, we didn't do any Diplo group. We didn't do any Diplo tech because we're going to go ahead and do a Diplo tech group or a Diplo idea group. So let's hop in here. We're going to go for diplomatic ideas. Why? Well, one nice thing, unjustified demands are cheaper. Another nice thing, this is like having a statesman in your pocket. Another nice thing, permanent CBs against no one is against people who aren't kingdoms. And of course, plus two relations and another diplomat. So that's worth getting. Let's do that. And let's get a couple ideas for it right off the bat. Why not? Okay, that'll help us out with our limit. It's still still four, but the next the next 400 Diplo points we get will go and um, add to that max. We'll have max of six. And we're about to tech up our military as well, which will put us at a significant advantage in India because we're about to be tech five, whereas everyone else is... Okay, I, I said that too quick. They're tech five as well. Oh, well, well Delhi's tech three. Man, Malwa must have some good kings. Oh my god! That's why he's tech 5. Look at that, he's 556! Five, five, Delhi's a 031. Malwa's a 556! Five, five, oh my god, can I have your babies? Please. I want Malwa babies. Look at that. 55. Five. Oh, I'm jelly. I am so jelly. Look at that. Bengal's over there with the tech 3. BJ's got tech 3. Bamanis has tech 3. Delhi has tech 3, the Timurids, oh, even the Timurids are tech 4, but Malwa's like, fuck you bitches, I'm tech 5. That is very surprising, Malwa, very surprising. Anyway, we got a free diplomat, so let's get him, um, let's go to Balochistan, why not? Why not? What was that? No guy, ah, Timurids have peaced out, no guy, no guy will concede defeat, all right. Whew, goodness. Oh, that finished. Alright, start a new one. There you go. Save as. There we go. Just one second. Okay. Onward. Can we tech up yet? Not yet. Anyway, we are actively converting lands to Sunni because obviously we don't want Hindu lands, we want Sunni lands. But yeah, I'm surprised Malwa is just, wow, burning through those texts like nobody's business. All right, well, we finally caught up with him. Let's upgrade our dudes to Muslim dual infantry. It pretty much doubles their effectiveness, which is very nice. 
And yeah, VJ is going to 100% annex Gujarat. And that's not really cool for us. Gain inflation or national tax goes down for five years. Uh, I'll take the inflation. Malwa broke their alliance with Bengal. Okay, yeah, that's good. Malwa, you have one ally. You have a really shit ally, Malwa. Did I mention your ally was shit? Because it is. Oh, Malwa, you and your coalition. Stupid coalition. Alright, how goes the missionary? Pretty good, actually. He's going at 4.2% per month. Nice. Very nice. Oh, England's declared war on Ireland. And Gujarat is now 100%. Yep, completely annexed by VJ. Wow. VJ, you are OP. But he might lose an alliance or two because of that. Uh, let's see. Amednagar, Miwar, and Barar. Yeah, he borders Amednagar and Miwar. So he'll probably lose those two allies. Unless he peacefully vassalizes them? I don't know. We'll see, I guess. But yeah, he's not too fond of me for some reason. I don't know. I didn't do anything to him. I didn't do nothing wrong. You can't prove anything. I'm a man. I'm 40. What's out there? Cultural shift. Oh, Jizya. I'll take Jizya. It will slow down our religious conversion, but more tax is more tax. And it's still going at a decent pace. Why not? Oh, what was that? Oh, he peacefully vassalized Amednagar. Fuck. VJ, you bully. VJ's a bully. And Bamanis. Surprise of all surprises, Bamanis is no longer friendly. Apparently that 45 aggressive expansion... Oh, there... Okay, Barar broke their line. That 45 aggressive expansion was enough to, enough to piss off Bamanis. Understandably so. Uh, Malwa is fabricating claims on me. Yeah? Yeah, Malwa has been discovered fabricating claim. Okay. It's fine. Not sure if you should really be attacking me, but um, go for it, dude. I have the Timurids on my side. What are you going to do about it? Nothing. Right. Okay, about to finish annexing Marwar. Or not annexing, converting Marwar. There we go. Now let's move on to Dehundar. At 3.3 per year. Nice. A uh, 3.3 per month. That's not bad. Let's go stand over there. Help lower the revolt risk with an active military. It does help a little bit. 6.4 becomes... Well, we'll see at the end of the month, I guess. Probably like five and a half, maybe a little less. Castile's declared war on Morocco. Okay, fair enough. Oh, yeah. Wow, having that army there helps a lot. Cool. Anyway, we're almost done coring Lower Dobe. We'll have to convert it at some point, but, you know, one step at a time. Wow, there's actually a lot of Avadi culture up here. You're Rajput. That's fine. I'm Rajput, too. Hmm. And Cindy. Cindy will never be accepted. It's just not enough base tax. There are so many cultures over here. Look at this. Rajput, Marathi, Avadi, Kanauji, Punjabi, Cindy, Gujarati. So many cultures. And none of them have very many provinces, so it's like they're, none of them are ever going to be accepted. And that's sad. That's kind of sad. I would prefer if they would all be accepted. <laughs> you know? Oh well. Core's coming in lower dough. Very nice. Can we annex Cathawar now? Yes, we can. Alright, come back. Let's get this party started. Alright, that'll take um, 9 years, or 11 years, that's fine. Now, Balochistan, I'm not sure we really need to annex them. We might want to hold on to them, because those 8 units could be very useful. And besides, he's going to have better tech than both these guys, because Sindh and Kathawar are both in the Indian group, but Balochistan is in the Muslim group, so he'll have better units than those two. So I think I'll keep Balochistan as a vassal for a while, for the time being. Might as well. We'll just annex these guys, and then we'll look at getting new vassals. Like, Jonpur would be a good vassal. 
Uh, Barar would be a good vassal. Ahmednagar. If I could steal that from VJ, that'd be great. Who knows? What does VJ have for an army anyway? Oh, VJ, tell me about your many millions. He has 40,000. What? 40,000. What do the Timurids have? 21. Oh, VJ, please don't hurt me. Uh, yeah, come back from Balochistan. We're actually going to spend some time improving relations with VJ. Uh, wow. 40,000. That's not OP at all. Please don't hurt me. I mean, he is tech 3, but still. 40,000. There's no way we can fight that. The Hansa have moved their capital. It says to Lubeck, but it means from Lubeck. To where? Um, where'd you move your capital? Hansa. Oh, here it is. He moved his capital to Bremen. Why would you do that? I guess he prefers this trade node. Isn't that a different trade node? No, it's the same. Why would you move? What the? He moved his capital out of an important center of trade in Lubeck with 12 base tax over to Bremen, which is not an important center of trade. It is an estuary, but still. Uh, with 8 base tax. I, I wouldn't move. I would stay in the base 12. Ah, whatever. All right, core almost done. Lower dobe, lower dobe. And that crisscross will go away. Goodbye, crisscross. Yay, we've cored lower dobe. Now, that should be an accepted culture right away. Avadi, because it's base six. No? Really? Damn it. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it is accepted. Good. That means any land we take from Jaunpur or Malwa will be accepted as well. Good. Nice. That means more income for us. Yeah, 5.7 ducats. Nice. Even with this uh, missionary advisor, Inquisitor, we're still making money. Good. Timurids broke the alliance with us again. Dude, you... Will you stop doing that? You fucking bastard. I guess we're going to go back to sucking up to Delhi. Timurids, that's the third time you've broken that alliance. You are a jerk. You're a big meanie, and I hate you. And you're ugly. I know that's harsh, but you need to learn. Ooh, gain stability. Oh yeah, give me that stability. I mean, well, 10 tradition would be nice. 10 tradition would be very nice. No, give me the stability. I can't pass that up. I can't pass up stability. Why have you gone domineering again? You have no CB on me. He's like, I can't attack you, but I'm going to go domineering anyway. Do -do -do. Fucking Timorids, man. Okay, they canceled fleet basing rights and they canceled military access. Yeah. Look at that. Broke alliance, negative 137. And it's only going away at 0.9 per year. Wow. Oh, we're now guaranteed by the Timurids. That means they want to attack you. Yeah. Cute. You don't have a CB on me, bro. You don't border me, bro. Like, I do not care. I am of the Timurid. We are awesome. You know what the silly thing is? If he's only got 17 guys, we could probably whoop his ass right now. Because we have, well, let's see. 5, 12, 20. We have 29,000. We have 12,000 more units than he has right now. You jerk. You're a jerk, Timurids. I'm not going to attack him. But if he attacks me, we can definitely win. Isn't that weird? So he's suddenly a lot weaker than he used to be. Oh, Kandesh has spawned. Oh, Kandesh has spawned. Hello, Kandesh. Do you have any cores or claims or anything? No. Ooh, can I peacefully vassalize you? No, you're Hindu. Stop being Hindu. Damn it. What is wrong with people being Hindu these days? You jerk. Ooh, yeah. Oh, look at Morocco. He's losing his whole coastline. 
He's like, please don't eat me. Wow, look at Haasa go. Holy shit, I've never seen Haasa do anything before. Look at this. What the hell, Haasa? Yeah, he's help with the help of Oman, he's just going nuts over here. He even has Medina. Wow. Nice job, Haasa. We're probably going to have to delete a couple units after we annex Sin, because that's going to be seven more guys. There's no way our... Uh, Actually, it might... Yeah, we might still be under our force limit. We'll see. So right now, we've just been consolidating our, consolidating our gains. We're converting culture, getting cores, all the stuff that needs to be done after annexing some land. Let's see. You hate Tibet... Pigou and Sean. You hate the Mamluks. I hate the Mamluks. You hate Bengal, Delhi, and Bomanis. You know what? I think I'm going to put Bomanis in there just to get VJ on my side. And I think a lot of people hate Bomanis, don't they? Oh, yeah. Lots of people hate Bomanis. Okay, good. What? Ming? What the? Why does Ming hate Bomanis? Bamanis is a landlocked nation that has no way of ever attacking Ming. And Ming's like, uh, I hate you, Bamanis. What the fuck, Ming? Seriously, that makes no sense. Whatever. Whatever, game. <laughs> you are full of shit today, game. Yeah, I don't really want to annex... Twitch chat is saying to annex Balochistan. The problem is, I don't really want to annex them. They have a decent amount of base tax uh, and a small navy. And they, they are Muslim tech group. So they're going to be my best ally because they can't ever break our alliance. And they're going to have decent technology because they're in the Muslim group. Meaning all of their units will fight better than the Indian units over here. So having Balochistan as my vassal is actually really, really useful more useful than Bengal, even though Bengal has twice their, more than twice their units. Three times their units. Doesn't matter. Because Balochistan, when they're Tech 10, Bengal will still be Tech 5, you know? It's a big difference. Stupid coalition. Bastards. Yeah, I don't understand why Bamanis is uh, the target of Ming's hatred. They just are. <laughs> I don't think Bamanis has any idea why they're the target either. And it's like, I don't know. All right, let's start converting Lower Dobe. Just convert all the things. If Bengal and Delhi ever break their alliance, uh, I will definitely just instantly go to war with Delhi, because... <laughs> Yeah. Actually, Bamanis might attack Bengal. And if Bamanis attacks Bengal, then I will definitely help them against Delhi. Yeah. Is that your only ally? It is your only ally. Perfect. Go on, Bamanis. Go kill Bengal. <laughs> they won't do it. Bengal's got 25,000 guys. Holy shit, is Bengal strong. 25,000 guys. Look at you. Then again, VJ has 40. I'm a man. I'm 40. Oh, no, no, no. They've actually, they've actually dropped 10 guys. I wonder why they dropped 10. Is it too expensive? I don't know. Anyway, up our limit. There you go. And now we are more tolerant of other religions. Good. We've upped our relations limit to six. So that means we can get a marriage with the Ottomans if they'll ever take us. Will you please invite me into your bedchamber, Ottomans? Looks like the answer is no. Hmm. Oh, well. We asked politely. All right, that should be the end of Sind. Uh, March, April, yeah, two more months and then Sind is gone. All right. Goodbye, Sind. Thanks for your seven units. I'll probably have to delete some because they're going to be very expensive. 
but thank you for helping me in my many wars. You've been a decent vassal, if not good. All right, go back to the auto derps. Yeah, get them to like us again. Goodbye. Yay! And we finished our mission to create an army for our nation. God, we're over. Um, yeah, we're over by a bit. Let's get rid of. Still over? Oh my god, really? Oh, the fleet. Do we not need the fleet? Oh, we don't need the fleet. Um, is it just one ship? No, he's got some trade ships. You know what? I'm okay with trade ships. Our, our fleet limit should go up. Right? No, it's only going to be three? Alright, fine. Delete two of the ships. Damn it. And we'll get more trade ships after we annex Cathawar. I mean, delete the cog. We don't need that. Okay, now we're not over our trade ship limit. Okay, we're back to making money. Just a tiny bit, but hey, I'll take it. Making money is making money. And really, Cindy is not going to be accepted. Oh, there it is. Now it's accepted. Okay. The problem with Cindy is... You know how many provinces in the entire world have Cindy culture? Yeah. Two provinces. Two provinces in the entire world have Cindy culture. So it's not going to be accepted for very long. Very short period of time accepted. Ooh. Revolt risk and lower dobe and lose piety. Or spend money to gain piety. I'll take the piety. That's a lot of money to spend, though. But um, piety is piety. That'll help us convert a little faster. Why not? Book burning. Gain piety. Nice. Didn't even cost us a penny. Uh, we can get relations up with someone. Let's go back to Bengal. Make sure they still like us. There you go. Ah, oh, we look nice. Grenada. Uh, let's bring some more derps over this way. We have no revolt risk anywhere. Oh, this is nice. And of course, Sindh is the right religion, so that's cool. Cathawar is not the right religion, so we're going to have to spend some time converting all these provinces. They're all wrong. But we are going to get some sugar. Nice. Sugar and cotton. I approve. What did we get here? We got uh, cotton and cotton. Cool. We're actually making two ducats a month right now. Very nice. I can handle that. That means another advisor. Actually, yeah, that does mean another advisor. Can I get an advisor for better relations? I could, but it um, costs 20 ducats to hire. Damn. Damn and blast! Very expensive advisors. Malwa. Yeah, I would like to attack you, Jonpur. I would love to attack you, Jonpur. I wonder if Benga would help us. Probably. Although he hasn't rivaled any of them, so he may not be interested in a war. France will see... Oh, England will cede Calais to France. England will renounce their claims on Picardy, Lombard. Normandy, Gascony, and Armniac. England will pay 108 ducats. Alright, so France got Calais. And England lost all of his claims. Everything. Oh, no, no, no. He still has two. Or whatever. He lost most of his claims. And in the meantime, Leinster is beating up on what's left of Ireland. Although Munster seems to be annexing Leinster <laughs> in the meantime. It's just a big three-way. And Scotland is beating up... Oh, no, 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 no. This is... What? <laughs> Leinster declared war on England. Leinster declared war on England. And that, has what that is what has brought Scotland into this war. Who's the war leader? Leinster is. Oh, God. <laughs> Leinster is the war leader. So Scotland's not going to get anything out of that war. Poor Scotland. Poor Scotland. What a world. Timurids are still domineering. Damn it. Go away, Timrids. No one likes you. I really wish we could get an alliance over here with these derps, but they don't seem interested. I mean, we have enemy of enemy. Eh. 
not sure what we could do to get him interested, really. Probably nothing. Oh, we actually have range for Kashmir now. Uh, and a couple other places, but not Ceylon. Well, I don't see there's any real need to go anywhere other than Ceylon. Ceylon is the only place that pushes into our capital, into Indus. So what's the point of putting our spare merchant anywhere else? Probably nothing. Uh, just go to Ceylon. Oh no, it's right, of course. The range is 201, our max is 200, of course. Uh, go to Kashmir, whatever. Do our best to transfer, I guess. <laughs> oh, Nepalese nationalist, nice. France is guaranteeing Tuscany, okay. Some war in Europe, okay. Oh, yep. go Nepalese nationalist, you're in the mountains, right? Yeah, he's in the mountains. Come on, Nepalese nationalist. Don't die. Damn it, he died. <laughs> oh, oh well. Yeah, and VJ seems to have done a good job of coring all this stuff. Yeah, there's no revolt risk or anything, so yeah. Darn it, VJ, you OP. Still has 32 units. Miwar and Barra. I wonder if we could win that war. We might be able to win that war. I'm not sure. Well, he is catching up on tech. I just don't know. Oh, Johnpur broke their alliance with Malwa. Really? Oh, goodness, Johnpur. Here, can I get a claim on you, please? I still have you as a rival. Yeah, let me get a claim on you, since you have no allies. And let's just go vassalize you. Why not? Why not? Look at you with your no allies. That's so cute. Oh, god damn it. He just got his alliance back with Malwa. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> he broke the alliance and then he got it right back. He's like, just kidding. Lol, 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 just kidding. Oh, and then they broke it again. What? Why? There is definitely some buggy stuff going on with the AI regarding alliances. Wow. And now they got their alliance back again. Holy shit. What in the world is going on? What is happening to my world? Okay, we've maxed relations with the Ottomans. Can we please get something? Yes, marriage. Yes. Just barely. Get me that marriage. Get me that marriage. Arr. That might be enough to get the alliance, too. Probably not. No. Distance is still a problem. But marriage is a marriage. I'll take it. Come on. Let me do of the click. Let me do of the click. I must be of the do click. Yes. Yes. Oh, come on. Go friendly. Go friendly. He might go friendly. If he goes friendly, then distance won't be a problem. All right. Well, we got our claim. But uh, he has an alliance right now. So we'll wait for that alliance to go away. And then we'll go in. But until then, we're just going to stay calm. I'll uh, we'll get relations back up with the di with the Derperids. Yes, their new name is the Derperids. Because they can't make up their mind. There we go, they just broke their alliance. Wow. You guys are... That's the third time you've broken your alliance in the last, like, week and a half. Wow. And Bengal has joined me. Yay!
Slow down time. He's going to go fight Bengal in Bihar, and I'll just go straight to his capital. Looks good to me. Yay! Alright, now he's leaving me alone. Now he's not. Very awkward. There we go. What is with this guy? He keeps changing his mind. It's like the same thing with the whole alliance. He's like, I want it, I don't want it, I want it, I don't want it, I want it, I don't want it, I want it, I don't want it. Make up your fucking mind. <laughs> Here he comes again. He just wants to party, I guess. You know what? Uh, we'll just let it happen. I mean, it's... Bengal does not have the best military, uh, but ours is a little better. Let's see how it goes. We got the walls busted and everything. Oh, yeah. I don't know what I was worried about. Easy peasy. And a new vassal for us. Fantastic. Oh, VJ has rivaled us. Oh, that's no good. Oh, shit. Yeah, I can't really engage you, VJ. Believe it or not, you have, like, way more units than I ever will. So, I'm not really rival material. However... Uh, maybe we can get Miwar to like us or something? Oh, well, Miwar has no allies. Really? Oh, he peacefully vassalized him. Fuck you, VJ. You peacefully vassalized everyone. You know what? Let me get Malwa out of this coalition against me. We're going to have to use Malwa. Anyway, we're out of time for this episode today. Thank you guys for joining me. I've been Shen. You've been you. Come back next time for the vassalization of Jaunpur. And hopefully VJ Nagar will not declare war on us. But if he does, well, I'm going to pee myself. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.